I'm so tapped out. Welcome to Let's Play Skeleton Flower. A free, weird... It's called a cross-section of a particular time in a person's life, explored by browsing files in a fish, fictional obsolete operating system. Uh, there is an epilepsy warning on this. Subject features quite a bit of high-frequency flickering white on a black background. I'm kind of scared. But yeah, if you don't... If that sounds bad, go ahead and bail. So starting the game, three, two, one. My account has been inactive for two more years. Optimize. Uh, honestly, the chromatic aberration is already scarier. Photo resolution. All right, so the resolution has been reduced from 4K to one. So we've got some nice one, one pixel photos here. And it says in the, on itch.io, this is the free game, by the way. Um, it says all the photos in the piece are actual full resolution photos shrunken down to a resolution of one by one pixels. Timestamps the actual time the photos are taken. And the captions. I thought I had to sneeze, but I didn't. Um, Timestamps the actual time the photos were taken. The caption are written in plain text file as the photos were taken and only slightly edited afterwards. You see something suspicious, unusual? Call something. Call your conductor, Amtrak police. Ow. Okay, that's the flashing thing, I see. So, nice. May! I see. I, I, I'm thinking that one may have been edited more than lightly. The, the, the caption. Oh, maybe, maybe the white ones are the ones that we can read. Okay. A man walks in front of every painted door in the entrance. Wait, joystick. Does this enter? What what button is enter? Do I have to enter with it? This is so confusing. It clearly sees the input from my gamepad and visualizes it, but obviously it doesn't actually let me input like do anything. A bird in mid-flight, possibly a pigeon. Interesting. <coughs> Maybe that does something later. The moon, a street light. I got everybody, every amateur photographer's favorites over here. You with the flower over a pool at a railroad crossing. Ah, nice. My eyes are very thankful for this. Three cars ahead of us riding a curve on the right telephone pole. Bridge may ice. Bridge may ice in cold weather. I hate when bridges ice. It's just so inconvenient. There ain't no garage sale. Hmm. Uh, our, is our operating system updating here? Tuesday is Tony Hillside. Two pale paths which meet in an L. The right side of the picture disappears in smoke. A finger over the lens. A dark, fast-moving object in the foreground. It rains. So soft cactus spines against moss or new grass. I have no idea if there's like a story that we're like finding out through these or it's just a weird tiny moss stars. I, I'm, I'm, I'm getting some, there's a lot of rain in these things. Barbed wire fence, street light, starlight. Hmm. I don't know, this is just an experimental like you know, the concept of exploring your life by, you know, going back and finding... Wait, what? This photo is stuck in my phone. Never moved him. Okay, so I'm, I'm kind of thinking there must be a story in here. The sun. Sometimes it's hard to tell. Sometimes the... Zero by zero. Accidental. Night sky. Where the camera pointed directly at the sun through the intervening mass. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it could be either one of those. You know, th those are the two things I would guess if I had a black photo in my phone. Walking down the street towards the house, it's dark, dim greenery. Wait, can I just go straight to the next picture? Why is there joystick input? I'm pressing every button. Like. Wait, what are those other two? 
Okay, I, I am pressing literally every button on an Xbox. Uh, it's actually an Xbox One Elite Controller TM. Um, does not do anything. Accidental. Leg right in jeans. <laughs> Part of index finger. Chicken to buy. This is kind of neat now that I'm seeing more of it. It's like, you know, your own, you know, butt dialed photos, you know, some stupid artsy pictures of the moon. Some, you know, hey wife, I'm going to buy this chicken. Wait, I didn't actually read that. I did that thing where my eyes went over the words, but my brain's just checked out. And I think I've read it, but I have no... Walking down the sidewalk in the green. You know that wasn't I lived here. Yeah, there's no comprehension here. The chair has three legs. It's it's blinking. Zeb. Did other ones blink? Well, they're all blinking now. There's no sense at all. A yellow leaf to the right flies. Orbit in front. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Creaking sound of poorly built staircase. Are we getting some spoop? The scent of Datura. Okay, we're getting into some spooky shit. I think. One end was torn open, showing where whatever was inside had left again. I, I figured it might her face, four photos, different expressions. Her left. Feelings of hopelessness are all about the future, but they plague me in the present. Okay, so it's, it's, going, it's going in an interesting direction. I had hoped this was it, but I had no idea. Happiness is not possible. I come crushed for... ow. Torn. Stop that! I was trying to read, bro! An uncaring boot. Beyond repair. Why does this have a joystick input? Up! Oh. That throws a little bit there. Others can see a vibrant glacier, but I feel dead and s- <laughs> Oh. Like the legs that left me years ago. <laughs> Others can see a vibrant glacier, but I feel dead inside. I guess that's describing a smile. It's like- yeah, some people see a cactus over here, but in reality, I'm dead inside. I came back from the grocery store. She was hugging my jacket and crying. Getting kind of grim here. On autopilot, I was done brushing my teeth. I almost put my toothbrush in the jar by her sink. Then we got some dead wife situations. I can't understand why she left. Oh, we've got some divorced wife situations. Slightly less sad, I suppose. Caption goes here. Valid. Valid. Up. Oh, caption goes there. Yeah, ca captions, you know. Some, some, sometimes you gotta remember to put on your captions, bro. Don't caption me, bro. Is that is that all there was? Hmm. That's that. That's the end. Such a neat little visualizer for the input, but it doesn't. Hmm. Uh, this was also made for the. Initially made for the desktop archaeology show at the Museum of Human Achievement. Is that. Uh, it just exits immediately out. Okay, let's go back in there. Let's see personal Explorer Explorer. No, I don't think it's one of those games that acts different once you open it up once. Okay, can we go back from the original position? Underside of snail, five holes. Okay, now that's, that's apparently the, all there was to it. Huh. It was getting a little interesting towards the end there, but then it just stopped. It's, a, it, it's an interesting idea. I guess that's about all it is, but uh, still interesting.